Welcome back to LLRE Group's Texas Real Estate YouTube channel. I'm Lynn. Nah, and I'm T. Today we will take you to see a beautiful little house located only 15 minutes from Bel Air, 20 minutes to the medical center, and only five minutes from Sugarland. And more specifically, this house only costs $338,000, consists of four bedrooms, two and a half bathrooms, and 2,000 square feet. The tax here is only 2.8%, and this is without asking for a homestead exemption reduction. Yeah, let's not keep you waiting any longer. Let's go in and see this house. Builder supports an additional interest rate of 5.5% if you go with Builder's lender. In addition 5.5%, Builder is also supporting an additional 3% closing cost. Like Ms. Lynn said earlier, this house has four bedrooms, two and a half bathrooms, and an area of 2,000 square feet. Looking at it from the outside, this house may be a little small, small but wonderful. In addition to the four bedrooms and two and a half bathrooms, here everyone can see that this is a very lovely study room located right in front near the entrance. Uh, for example, in small houses, people find that there is little space to store things. But here everyone can see that it has a separate area that can store luggage. Things that I haven't used in a long time can be stored here. According to Lynn's comments, Lynn thinks this house has a very reasonable layout. Normally with small beautiful houses like this, people will often save a little space on the kitchen space, but not with this house. Like everyone you see, like the island space here, there is a very large countertop. And in addition, there are many cabinets here for you to store things with a total color of white. Even though at this price, this house, Lynn finds that the things people use are quite okay. From faucets, appliances, microwaves, and ovens, they are all made of stainless steel, giving the house a solid feeling. Also, this room, this is the pantry. Lynn also found it very spacious. Here it could be a walk-in pantry, and there is plenty of room for the ladies to keep their kitchen utensils. And what Lynn likes about this kitchen is that it has an exhaust system. This exhaust system will vent straight to the outside. If you go to buy a house and don't know whether this house has an exhaust system or not, remember to open the upper cabinet. And opposite the kitchen space is a small and pretty dining room space here next to a uh, window overlooking green grass. This house is a model house, so it is next to a lake, so it looks very comfortable and pleasant. The layout of this house is open concept. The kitchen, dining room and living room spaces are connected to each other, looking very bright. The space I am standing in is the living room space, as you can see. This living room space is quite large. Here they have decorated a set of L-shaped sofas that look very spacious. Here the TV will be on the other side of the wall. This house is suitable for young people just getting married or small families that need to live near the center. I think this house is very okay. As you often see, if it is a two-story house, all the bedrooms will be on the second floor and the first floor will usually be the family space. But with this builder, they placed the homeowner's master bedroom right on the first floor. Located in a corner opposite the living room, but also very private and convenient. And this is a beautiful little bedroom that is still very spacious. You can get rid of a king bed. The two nightstands are very, very big, but there's still plenty of space for everyone. From here, I went into the bathroom and saw that this bathroom was a good size. Here, in addition to a double sink and a place to shower, they also built an additional cabinet. Along with that, we also have a very large and spacious walk-in closet that is sure to be enough to store the couple's belongings.
What Asian people usually don't like is the stairs right opposite the main door. But with this house, you don't need to worry about feng shui. Because in this house, the stairs are located between the study room and hallway. Now let's go with Lin and T to the second floor to see what's on the second floor. After seeing quite a few houses of different builders, I found this house, their second floor layout is very airy and open. In addition to the three bedrooms located in the other direction, here we also have a game room for everyone to have space to play and entertain. One more thing I want everyone to pay attention to is that here we also have a small learning corner for our children. Here it is also quite unique and pretty. This house has four bedrooms and earlier T showed you that the master bedroom is on the first floor and the study room. On the second floor, we still have three additional bedrooms and three additional bedrooms. Lynn found that they all have a pretty good size compared to a house with 2,000 square feet and two floors. Well, look at this. With such an area, we can store a lot of things such as beds, tables and cabinets. There is also another closet. And over here will be the remaining two bedrooms, one on Lynn's left hand and one on Lynn's right hand. And here is the full bath. In the middle of the rooms, there is a secret door. Lynn is curious about what's in here. Actually, there is another storage room in here. This is a pretty good size for me to store my things. Here the builder also advertises that this builder's house will have something like spray foam insulation on the roof and on the attic. This is known to be a very good insulator and helps make your electricity bill cheaper. such a lovely house, four bedrooms, a brand new house with a price of $338,000, Lynn finds this price to be a very good price. In addition to the super attractive house price, the builder is currently also providing additional interest rate support of 5.5% if you go with the builder's lender. Compared to the current profit, 5.5% is a very good profit that you should take advantage of the opportunity. In addition to 5% of the profit, the builder is also supporting an additional 3% closing cost. Here, 3% means that if you buy a house for 300,000, the builder will give you 9,000 in return, so you can use it to close paperwork and procedural costs when you close the house. If you cannot get a loan from a builder lender, Lynn and T's team is working with many different lenders and they also have very good programs to support first-time buyers. So if you have questions, just call Lynn's team for further advice. The tax rate in this area, the tax in this area is 2.8% and the HOA here is only $700 a year. Currently, there are a total of 113 houses in this area and this area is very hot. Builder has sold 40 units already and has a few units listed for sale. For those of you who want to buy a ground floor house and don't like an upstairs house, here there are a few one-story house options. The ground house area is from 1,300 to 1,400 square feet for just under $300,000. Houses in this area will belong to the Fort Bend ISD School District. In addition, I want to reiterate a little more about the location. This area is only 15 minutes from Bel Air. If people go to Medical Center, it is only 20 minutes and Sugarland is only 5 minutes. Plus, there are many markets around here and people can travel very conveniently if you need to go shopping on the weekend. Thank you for watching Lynn and T's video today. Hope everyone likes this video. If you are interested in this area or need to sell or buy a house in Houston, Texas, please call Lynn's team immediately at the phone number right here so we can advise further. Thank you and see you again in the next video.